What's up everybody? Greg here coming from Santa Fe, New Mexico. Got my 2019 Chevy Colorado ZR2 Bison with the Lear 180cc commercial rack with the Thule heavy duty um, bars on there. But ultimately, we got an, we got an eye camper X cover that we're about to install. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and and uh, get it up there and we'll do a little walkthrough of what this beauty's all about. Here we go, it's the first look. Just pulled off the top. Got a user manual here, I'll look through. I bet you these are the mounts, sounds like. I mean, this is pretty plug and play. Looks like it has a nice little uh, shipping cover to protect it. But uh, this should be pretty plug and play. Hardest part for me is just gonna be tossing that puppy up there and getting it uh, mounted. But uh, obviously we're excited, so we got the extra energy to push that up there. Let's see what we got in here. So here we go, just opened up the uh, mounting bracket packet. Looks like we got, these are look pretty heavy duty. They also appear to be stainless steel, which is nice. Um, quick uh, the do's and don'ts and I mean this is really just getting this on the on the rail and then um, getting everything to fix so not a whole lot of parts to this and there's the instructions here mounting rail crossbar get that on there so I'm gonna go ahead and mount these on first and then this slides on to my uh, bars, my Thule bars. So let's see, it looks like uh, this shouldn't be too big of a, of a deal. But I'll walk through it and uh, we'll get this installed and do a little walkthrough. All right guys, so putting this, uh, these little mounts that attach the, uh, the tent to your bar system, pretty, pretty simple. Um, all you got to do is just run these through the rail as such and the way I'm doing it is I got my threaded the threaded piece first and then after will be the non threaded piece and then that's where this big bolt runs through and, and connects there and all I'm doing to get those in place is Basically a little shoulder lift here, sliding them over. This one can go right there. And I'll be able to and be able to connect this to the threaded piece. That probably takes the longest amount of time is just threading that on there. But there's four of those to do. They give you a nice little eye camper tool to tighten um, to tighten that bolt I didn't see any I mean the the clamp itself acts as kind of a nut on the back side but I would st I was still kind of thinking to myself um, what else is there to, to really make sure that those bolts don't come loose especially for you guys out there doing a lot of off-roading so That'll be something to look at and just uh, maybe think about even reach out to I camper see what they're hearing about that but if you want to take a look pull off man I've already got it mounted up to the top it just hasn't been secured but uh, I like the way it looks the I camper X cover it's it's a big tent uh, I'm a big guy usually hang out with big guys so um, if there's a couple of us in there we're gonna be nice and cozy but yeah it's it's a big tent uh, hope you guys like the look of that I know I'm digging it pretty happy so far uh, just even knowing that the magic is still under there but right there man there's that look loving it can't wait to catch that first little night's sleep in there tonight but there's the eye camper